Greetings, dear ones. Here's your weekend channeled inspirational reading for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, December 12th, 13th, 14th, 2014. The number one Passion Ignited card came up by Sarita. The Psychic Tarot Oracle deck by John Holland was used for this reading. You can have anything you want if you want it desperately enough. You must want it with an exuberance that erupts through the skin and joins the energy that created the world. A quote by Sheila Graham. This Friday, Saturday, Sunday is looking to be quite a robust time. Some of this week's earlier themes which show themselves as important will come to the forefront even more so. You can grab a piece of good insight by looking back at snippets from the readings from this week to see how this weekend may come on the scene for you. Life loves to repeat itself. It could be a serious time when you will want to increase your personal power, your inner growth, in a way. Since this week was fueled with so much energy, so much synergy to carry you into your projects to further them, you know what you must do already by the end of the week. In fact, even the energy that you need, the initiative to follow through is there for you as well. This week, you'll need to curb the desire to growl at people who may seem to slow you down or to get into your way as you make a fast break to abundance. It's clear that you have been working on yourself, and that newness is shining from some of you right now. Let it be an experience and embrace the day. All that you have your hands into as you explore then mold the possibilities of your skills from your abilities is getting good now. Don't fret since you're sharing the wealth with the world by totally feeling in awe of what you're doing. It may seem as if you're being selfish, but no. Although you may not have been thrilled with the process and the steps to getting to where you want to go, for much of the journey, it's still flowing in a delicious way you are seeing this more and more. If life couldn't get any better, for those of you who read over this or who are reading this, we can promise that it can and will this weekend as you spiritually expand, seeing the ways that you have changed to be better than you were just this time last year. In the past, you may have fought with the notion that you are deep, that you are an empath who is also spiritual and savvy in the way of the new age experience. Now, you're no longer running from your own expansion since it's cool to be whatever you like, whatever you want to be. There's some feeling of soaring in all that you do and it's really truly beautiful love. So just chart out that plan. This is a chance to do, this is a chance to do, to have a do over and so you want to go and get the plans written out so that you can visualize and examine more of what you're pondering. More of what you're pondering doing, beginning, going into, finishing up, and completing. The month of December just got better with the energy of spiritual love on the brink. You'll probably find yourself and others to be seeking a glorious relationship with someone already in the mix. Some have been open to someone new since they have held a space by themselves as a single dove for a while. The holidays usually, usually remind many of the importance of connections and love and in business too. It's also good to just connect with others for the thrill of making magic and romance and romantic relationships along with friendships and stuff. These are the times when someone is just there imagining their world as not just one, but also as within a unit with a beautiful family. Anything that you want can be if you want it bad enough. If you will be happy more than feeling bad, then you can energize even more. Your joy is your wand. A positive attitude can work wonders when it's genuine too. If you're reading this, then you know it. Sometime, you forget just how powerful, how enchanting you can be. Ah, just watch out now because the whole world, the whole world will feel you coming before they see you. So hold on to what you want, lovelies. You can still pull in more of what you desire. Feel it. Feel your power. Then go. 
with another stream of big time holidays just around the corner, don't get, please don't get caught up in sadness trying to think of when to get this or who to get this for or who to get that for. You can always keep it simple, beloveds. Instead of others, you may perhaps want to focus on what you really want to see in your life. This is truly your, 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 just your breathtaking show. So that's all for now. Subscribe to us on YouTube to listen to these readings, lovelies. Mwah. Have fun. We appreciate you. If you need more clarity, go back to read this week's daily readings. We guarantee you'll find what you seek for now. Remember your peace. We look forward to your comments, tags, and sharing as always. And I look forward to you booking a reading with me as well as the holidays are almost here. And it's almost a new year. So, you know, go to the website and look up the page that shows rates. You can also look up how I do my readings. And if you have any questions, I do offer a free 15-minute consultation over the phone. Or we can do it through email. Beyond that, we look forward to your comments, tags, and sharing as always. We care for you so very much. Sayofia, Sarita Spiritual Guide for you. It's all love. Take care. And if you'd like a one-on-one reading with me, which I'd love to have one with you, Check out my website so you can book a time with me at www.naturallyhighlife.com. And I look forward to speaking with you, connecting with you on YouTube and Instagram. Please, please, please follow me there and subscribe and leave your comments and please share. Peace and be well. Everything is going to be just fine.